2022, you want to talk about the women is king and say, I'm not talking about Black Panther. In 2019, when it's when Black Panther is everywhere, I'm trying to tie it together and make it clear that these people traded slaves and that this image, it shouldn't be allowed and shouldn't be celebrated by Black folks. Where were you at? Oh, talking about it's a fictional kingdom? Well, that's not what Times was saying. That's not what Times was saying in this article in 2018. Hmm. Gonna wear that costume. We're gonna talk about the woman is the woman king, the woman king, a historical epic inspired by the true events that happened in the kingdom of Dahomey, one of the most powerful state of states of Africa in the 18th and 19th century. Produced by Viola, starring Viola, director Gina Prince. Blythewood, let's go back. Strong military used power to get rich on slave trade. Who were the Dahomeans? No group possibly in the world would allow this. Not to have the voice and the right to speak without getting cut down the way that we do. But we do. It makes no sense to me until you understand not enough people understand the gravity of what I'm proposing. I'm proposing that if you don't understand this disrespect, ain't no millions that can fix it for you. This is the basic root of like peoplehood, your boundaries, your lineage, and what people can't step over. Then we move to what people owe you. And if you don't understand those di dynamics, then I don't know. It's going to be a tough road in this kind of country. Viola Davis leads the real life Dora Milaje. So, I keep going back because it's a two-part hook to the show. One, the general understanding of the Dora Lodge and the woman king in context of the homie. But two, what it takes for a thought leader to criticize the woman king, then feign that the ignorance or feign that the Black Panther is different by basis of it's a fictional story. When we know, based on so many sources, that's, it's based on and created out of a very real story of the homie, the very homie you just criticized. But you don't want to criticize those, that part. It will be interesting to see how the movie that seems to that seems to glorify the all female and understand what seems to is. It's hedging. It seems to glorify the all female. It will be interesting. It's never an outright statement that we need to boycott a film. It's never a statement standing on some tubes. It's always diluting what we talking about. Diminishing the impact of what we need to get done. It will be interesting to see how a movie that seems to glorify the, the all-female military unit of the, the homie deals with the fact I don't need no interest in, I don't need no seems to, I just know the movie shouldn't be made. And that's just my view. I need my thought leaders that sell slavery through projects. It ain't like we're doing autobiographies. It ain't like we're doing art. We selling slavery through the 1619, and you can't say it straight that this movie shouldn't be made. But then on top of it, when it's time to actually talk about the extensions of the movie, you try to disassociate it because of a number of possible factors. The first being you just don't understand the connection is just clear. I'm not talking about Black Panther. You're not talking about Black Panther, but you're talking about the Dahomey, you're talking about women, is, women King. But well, hold on. In the promotion, they talking about it. This is entertainment. Entertainment tonight. Viola Davis leads the real life Dora Milaje, which is the Dora Milaje come from Wakanda, to fight colonial invaders in thrilling the Woman King trailer. Meet the Agoyjo, an all-female war unit based on the African fighters who inspired the Dora Milaje in Marvel's Black Panther. 